Welcome to Less Nest Today, taking baby steps to loving our homes. Hey folks, so this is what I'm working on today. This is my little tea drawer um, on our island and I did love these little dividers but I got something I think is going to organize it a little bit better. So I'm gonna declutter it and then um, try out the new organizers. Let's get started. Yep, I'm clearing clutter in my PJs today, folks. Well, I started by checking all the Best Buy dates and all the teas in this drawer. I knew I had some of the teas for years because I didn't like the flavor when I first tried it. And some of these teas I got as gifts, but truth be told, I don't really like black teas or green teas. I'm an herbal tea kind of gal. And isn't it funny that we know we don't like something, but instead of getting rid of it because it's new or it's a full box or because we don't want to be rude, we leave it telling ourselves that we'll use it eventually. Well, clearly that wasn't the case with some of these teas. I also store some of my little ginger candies that I like and the hot chocolate bombs my kiddos like in this drawer. So I pulled those out too. And I have a pill, a vitamin box in this drawer that I, that I store. Once everything was out and the Best Buy days checked, there weren't very many teas left. I'm embarrassed to say that the oldest tea was from 2017. Well then, I gave a good wipe down of the drawer and the liner, something sticky on that liner. I'm not sure what it was, maybe some honey. And then I put everything back in. I was excited to try these new caddies that I picked up from Amazon. I only purchased two, even though I measured the drawer and I knew they'd fit because I wanted to see if taking the teas out of the box and having a little caddy was actually something that I enjoyed. And I do. I love being able to see the names of the teas there and not having to dig around through a box. So I'm gonna get two more for this space. I can even keep the little candies and the hot chocolate bombs in a section of the caddy, so they're contained too. Now, since I measured this space, I do know that I'll have about five inches left over and I, when I, once I put all four caddies in. So I'm gonna look on Amazon and see if I can find a little storage box that fits the area and that kind of matches the wood color of the tea caddies and the divider. Or, I don't know, maybe I'll leave it as it is. We'll see. I'm just excited to have this drawer cleared out of all the old teas. And these new tea caddies, I know it sounds weird, but they do bring a smile to my face. I love it. So here is the final product. And um, yeah, I had lots of expired tea, you guys. I'm so embarrassed. Shall I show you the one that was the oldest? <laughs> don't judge, don't judge. This tea, after dinner mints, Actually, there might still be 20 bags in there. Maybe I tried it, didn't like it. I usually love mint tea. Um, anyway, this one is from <laughs> September 3rd of 2017, best before. Anyway, so yes, I decluttered a lot of tea that had expired, and I'm excited because um, I do really love these, these little tea organizers. I'm going to get two more because we do love tea. And then I think they have a single slot of this on Amazon as well. And I'm going to get, because I have room for two more, and then... I'll do a single slot in the back because we do like our chocolate, hot chocolate bombs. Um, I do like my little uh, ginger candies for after dinner. So that will be the holder for um, those kind of things. So there you have it. I will put a link in the comments in case you're interested for these little tea caddies, which I love. And then I just use my separator here um, to keep them that I already had. Also on Amazon, I'll link that as well, um, to keep them from sliding all over because they were a little... Um, there's a little space left. So let me know what you guys think.